Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Command and Conquer, the Nod Campaign. And when last we left off, we unfortunately managed to let a single harvester get a single load of Tiberium and head straight back to their uh, base, meaning that they got all of their money back. Although we don't even need a full load to achieve that, all they actually need is one single piece of Tiberium. With a single piece, they would be able to uh, get absolutely Building. all of their silos and the um, refinery, I believe, filled to maximum. Which um, isn't that fantastic, but we can win either way, even though we've done that. So um, we're going to make sure that we're very careful because there will be another, um, there'll be another harvester building pretty soon. Although they are already quite low on money, and as you can see, all of the enemies seem to be focusing, especially the uh, vehicles, on the um, recon bike that did the attack. Which is um, quite good if you want to be able to direct your opponents there. As you can see, there is another harvester being built right there. And is now heading out to go and get some um, actual Tiberium. We're going to stop them from getting that Tiberium by launching a very, very sudden attack. Uh -oh. Where are you going? You appear to be heading back. You have got enough, um, unless you're heading, ah, you're heading this way. That's fine. We can deal with that. I thought you had enough there, but you don't. We need to get you before you've done that, and now we're just going to head this way and lure you all the way down here. Because down here lies your destruction. We need a few things to ensure that the, um, we don't lose a lot of units when we go to attack, although realistically we don't actually need that many units. A few artillery pieces and a few, um... A few flame tanks is really all we require. There we go. Goodbye, Harvester. So long and farewell. Right, another flame tank, and uh, I think that's probably enough, actually. Then again, we do have a lot of tanks just sort of hanging around doing nothing. A lot of tanks just sort of hanging around doing nothing. But that's not a bad thing, as I think they have really run out of money now. So I want you guys to head up here to uh, this entrance, and I want a single engineer. That engineer we built very early on to uh, go and stand there as well. This is going to be the force that we're going to use to uh, take out that base. Hello, how are you? You did not do very much there at all, and even what you did do was really ineffective. What we want to do is we now want to put a, um, we need to put these bikes over there. The reason why those bikes need to go there is because while we start attacking this base, they will start selling things. And when they start selling things, they will inevitably get enough money for another, a single, mind you, but they'll have enough money for a single extra harvester, probably. And we don't want them to get that at all. And so what we want to do is we want to make sure that um, whatever harvesters they build get killed in much the same way as all the others. Step one, start getting them to sell their uh, defenses here. We need to be very careful though that they don't uh, get too badly damaged because they're really, really vulnerable. That's why we have the, um, the flame tanks here. There we go. I have no idea what you're doing, but that pretty much cost us that... Um, that cost us that, and that's not very good at all. Alright, where are you going? You're not heading down, which is handy. Okay, you're sort of heading... You're heading in the same path that you always go, which is fine. Alright, next step is that we need to be very careful in um, taking out a select few buildings. We need to do it in a certain order. Moving out. Starting with this uh, construction yard here. Once the construction yard is gone, they can't rebuild anything that they sell. At the moment, anyway. There will be other missions where there are um, multiple construction yards, and they'll even be able to rebuild construction yards in that instance. There we go. One construction yard gone. And we want to defend this as much as we can. There we are. Ooh, you're going to... Well, we just lost our uh, engineer, which is unfortunate, because the engineer was slightly more northern um, on the map than the Nod Buggy. Unfortunate, but we should be able to cope with this. Hopefully, anyway. We have more than enough Tiberium. In fact, we have more than enough units, just period. Alright, a little further south. There we go. Bye-bye, Advanced Guard Tower. You will perish. The next thing we want to go and deal with is um, the barracks, actually. 
The barracks are very important to take care of. We could do that with the, um... There we go, there's that harvester. You see that harvester? That harvester needs to get, um, attacked much the same way as all the others were. There we go! This way! Down here! Follow the recon bikes to your destruction! Meanwhile, we're going to go and, uh, deal with everything else. Starting, of course, with the barracks, because why not? Hello, barracks, how are you? You're about to get hit with fire! Ha <laughs> ha! A terrible thing for you, because without any barracks, you're not going to be able to build any more units. And now you're not going to have a war factory, and without the war factory, you won't be able to build another of the harvesters. There we go! And without any of these, the advanced guard tower won't work. I think we pretty much took care of everything we need to. We need to be very... Aha! Starting to sell things, I see? That's really not going to help you, though. We, in the meantime, are going to send this down here to uh, take care of these guard towers. And I think these won't have any more power, which is pretty good. There we go. You can just uh, do that while you deal with this. A little bit further forward, and this guard tower will be destroyed. And these engineers will be killed. I think we've pretty much won here. Wouldn't you say so? I would. We're going to move this ready to uh, take this facility here while we just destroy everything that we can. And for some reason they're repairing even though there's really not much point. Absolutely no point in fact. Why even bother? Because it's not like you can actually build any more units. I mean in theory if they had an engineer, they could send the engineer and take my construction yard or take my refinery, or, yes, or the Hand of Nod even, but they have no money to actually do that, which is um, quite helpful for us. Oh, one uh, minigunner there. Well, there was one minigunner. Now there are no minigunners. And with uh, this uh, orca pad here, they now have pretty much nothing, and we have absolutely loads, which is very, very handy. How are our silos looking? Only half full. Not bad. We're going to save right now because uh, this is the point where you get to decide the final mission that you want to do. So let's go and take this here. Mission successful! Time to tally up our score. Let's see here. Total score is not too bad. The ending credits is a lot, and that's going to be quite useful. What about the casualties? A lot of GDR units, and not so many not ones. Definitely in comparison, the ratio is quite extreme. What about buildings lost? We lost two, GDR lost 14. I think the battle map is going to be very skewed to nod. But we'll have a look. We gained a lot, and what did they gain? Nothing. We have three ways to go in. Which way do we pick? I think we're going to pick this one. South Africa. Let's go. We have reached the end. The final piece to my puzzle is within your grasp. Two GDI bases rest on ground I have chosen to be the cradle of my temple. Remove them in any way you can. I have no idea what's to come here. We're going to uh, move all of our units. There we go. And we're going to start building a few things. We want to build a uh, power plant. And we finally have access to concrete walls. Not that that's really going to uh, help us right now, but we want to see what's to... Um, what we're going to have to face. We don't have a lot of resources, so we're going to have to be very careful. There we go. We probably want a, um, I think we want a hand of nod here. Let's see if there are any, um, things that we can, uh, harvest. There should be. Otherwise, we're in a little bit of, there we go. There are some, uh, resources. Okay, what do we want to do? 
you want to uh, probably start saving up some money. Ooh, there's a uh, building. There's a uh, harvester there for GDI, which we need to be very careful about because we do not want to. Um, we definitely don't want to attack that because there will probably be a lot of units in this um, area that we want to uh, be very wary of. We don't have very much to. Um, to go with here. There's water to the south and water to the north, and I imagine they're crawling with gunboats. Crawling with gunboats. Yes, we just want to uh, play it safe here and be very careful. Very careful. Maybe a turret might help. A turret probably will help a lot, so let's build a turret, shall we? Yeah, there's definitely a harvester there that we need to make sure we... Oh, here come some uh, enemies. Some uh, units, just a few grenadiers and uh, other things. We really want to run these over. There we go, that definitely helped. Definitely helped. One turret will certainly uh, help even more. I think an airstrip is the next thing we want to build. And then we probably want to build a lot of uh, flame tanks, I'd imagine. Flame tanks are pretty good, and haven't seen any... Ooh, there is a, uh, There's a, uh, Humvee and a few other things. We really don't need to worry about a Humvee, though. A Humvee is nothing in comparison to, uh, what we're currently... Oh! That is sneaky. That is very sneaky. We're gonna need to build another, um, power plant pretty soon. There we go. We should be able to deal with these using the, uh, buggy, though. It's not too bad so far, although we are a little low on money. And I'm a little worried about... There is indeed a gunboat. I see one right there. That's really bad. There's probably one to the north as well that we need to watch out for. Most likely. So we'll put this here, shall we? There we go. And we're low on power, which is really bad. We could build an advanced power plant. That seems like a good idea. We might actually want to build a few of them. Just so that we um, don't have to worry about... Um, any power problems later on. Here comes another Humvee, which is not so bad. There we go. Right, we'll just deal with you. Brilliant. Oh, careful. Careful. Construction complete. Now we have power. We have loads of power. I think the next thing we want to do is we want to... Ooh, the Temple of Nod. 3,000. That is a very expensive building, but it's certainly going to be worth it when we eventually... Um, are able to build it. Okay, carefully does it. Very carefully. We have to be very careful. We might want to build a uh, silo or two as well at some point, just so that we can uh, ensure that we complete. don't run out of resources. There we go. One more silo. And a flame tank. We need a few of these, I wager. I think we probably need a few of them. Okay. What else do we want? Oh, very careful here. We don't want to destroy that just yet. Yes, sir. There's a bit of Tiberium. There's an unlimited source here, which is quite handy. Very handy. Okay, what do we want to do? We want another Building. flame tank. I think we want a few of these. The flame tanks are pretty good. They're very good. Maybe four of them might do. I know I've only built one harvester right now, but that's really because I don't see us needing a second one at the moment. Not yet, anyway. There only appear to be so many units here. Let's uh, do a little bit of exploring, shall we? See what we can find. Nothing here. Up there is probably where that gunboat is. And over here is probably where... Oh, more Tiberium. There's a lot of Tiberium here, actually. More Tiberium than I thought. All right. More exploring. Very cautiously. Very cautiously. More Tiberium. Lot of Tiberium. Affirmative. Affirmative. Anything else? Moving oh! Airstrikes! Right, gotta remember that airstrikes are a possibility Moving here. Out. Managed to avoid that quite well with the buggy, though. Very complete. well indeed. Building. Yes, sir. There appears to be some form of um, GDI base here. The uh, harvester out. kind of gave Moving that out. away, but we need to see how. Oh! Well, that might have been a mistake. That was probably a huge mistake. We might have lured a lot of enemies, but maybe yes, not. Yes, maybe not. Let's blow up this, um, here, shall we? No reason not to. Oh, that's probably a reason not to do it right now. But we can wait until it's back, I think. There we go. I think we'll build a fourth one. 
reinforcements have arrived. Actually, we already have four. I think we need some engineers building. now. We need some engineers. Because if there is a, um, if there's a refinery there, I have a cunning plan. But if we wait one moment, I'll be right back. Apologies for the interruption there. Let's move on. We have a fair Finish amount off. of uh, flame tanks here, and we need to be very careful of the, um, the airstrikes that we saw try to hit this buggy. If we have this buggy about here, then the buggy will be able to uh, deal with anything that comes our way. Also, we need to destroy this, uh, definitely need- Oh, that is a really poor idea. We need to destroy this now, I think. Now is a good time to do so. So that we don't uh, have to worry about- Oh, hello! You have sent units against us. This is a terrible decision. Because we have flame tanks, and flame tanks are really, really good at dealing with all of these. There we go, that's trying for some reason- Oh, hello! We have flame tanks! Do you want to know what flame tanks are really good at? Destroying what you have here. There we go, brilliant. It would appear that the um, harvester wants to go this way for some reason. I don't know why, but why don't we just deal with it? There we go. There we are, just a few more shots and it should be gone. I think we need to use this, though, because otherwise it's uh, going to get away. Oh, and we've lost that. And we're about to lose that at this rate, which is also really bad. Yep, move this a little bit further south, and we'll get another... Um, there we go. I think we'll get another engineer building. I think we're going to need a few if we're going to capture everything in there. The, um... Harvester is on its way back, though, so I think we can take it out with just a few more shots. There we go. Goodbye, Harvester. And with that, that Harvester is gone. I think maybe we want one more flame tank, and then we'll move on and try and take care of all the defenses here. Whatever defenses there are, that is. This way appears to be the route that will let us um, get there without getting attacked by the gunboats of the north or the gunboats of the south. There are a lot of gunboats. All right, let's just uh, move very carefully here. We want yes, four flame tanks before we try anything, and I think pretty much everything that we have here is rather safe for the moment. Only for the moment, though. We could use the, um, I wonder if we can put that there and it won't get attacked. It doesn't seem to be being attacked, which is quite handy. There are two gunboats, which is just ridiculous. There is, um, as we can see there, a guard tower, which is not great, but it doesn't seem like there's much else there. All right, one more flame tank, and then I think we'll be good to go. Construction complete. Excellent. We might want a, um, I don't know if we want a second one of the harvesters here. There is a lot of Tiberium here, including an unlimited source of it. But we really want to get rid of these um, gunboats. The sooner the better. And I think with four of these tanks, we should be able to uh, take out whatever's here. I think it's now time to move these... Uh, units over here. There we are. Carefully does it. Very carefully does it. And I think it's time to attack. There we go. A little bit of an attack here. And there we go. Was there only one? No, there are in fact two. I can see the second one right there. There we go. Now, there are none. Let's go deal with these units, shall we? You've been dealt with. You've been dealt with. You've been dealt with, and you've been dealt with. Wow, the sheer amount of money that is in those, um, silos there is absurd. Let's go and deal with that, shall we? Just get rid of these. There we are. Just need to have both of them attacking there. Okay, I, I think we're not going to be worrying about money for a... Oh, we lost a few things there. All right, we'll uh, take this. GDI building. And we'll take this. GDI building. And we'll take this. And I wonder if there's anything in here. Let's find out. GDI building. Yeah, there's quite a lot in all of them, actually. That was uh, quite good indeed. A lot of money. We're going to use that money now to uh, start building a few things. The first thing we're going to build is we're going to build some more of these uh, advanced... Um, Advanced building. power plants. It's quite important that we do, I think. There's one there. We could on actually hold. capture that. That's Cancel. actually building. more cost-effective. Yes, Anything else in here? Affirmative. 
There's two of them here. That's actually far more cost effective just to take those ones. And I think we will. There we go. With lots of power comes the ability to, um... Also, you're going to that one now, which I suppose is not too terrible. The only question now... Careful. Careful. The only question now, I suppose, is, uh... How are we going to uh, get over to the next part of the map? I wonder if there's a way to do that. Maybe we should build a uh, hand of nod here. Just to make it a little bit easier to um, get things built over here if there's any way to get over. I suppose having two is not going to hurt, is it? Probably not. There we go. A lot of power there. And what else do we have? You can actually do that and make that the uh, primary building. Let's have a look and see what's up here. Anything? Ooh, helicopters. Well, I think now I know... Do you really want us to put something there? I suppose we could. It's not going to hurt. We just need to use the... Um, just need to use these here to um, get access to that. I suppose if we're going to move to the next part of the um, area, we don't need this anymore. We definitely don't need that anymore. So we'll uh, use these uh, troops here to uh, go into those helicopters. Oh dear. I think we just lost something. And I think we might want to uh, have a flame trooper or two as well. There we go. So one and... We'll need six of these. There we go. We'll uh, put that there just to uh, distract some attention there. And a few of these. And so when we come back, folks... We'll make sure that, actually, I think we'll need a few more of them, because I think we need to uh, use those to capture it. Also, a few more engineers won't hurt. And so, when we come back, folks, we're going to have a, um, a little bit of an interesting experience here with um, two bases, effectively. We're going to have a base here, a base there, and a base somewhere over there. It's going to be intriguing, but then again, this is the last mission, so who knows what's in store? I hope this wasn't the. I hope this was one of the bases that uh, Kane mentioned we needed to uh, take over. Although knowing my luck, it probably isn't. So I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later.